Hello everybody and welcome to another ball review here on the channel this time for the planet earth bundle the earth ball yes it's earth day this week and gold flash is celebrating that by releasing the really lovely earth ball so before we start make sure that you do hit that thumbs up button also subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications if you do want to improve your game even more for tour play or for tournament play you go to patreon.com slash gold clash tommy link directly in the description down below so the earth ball the planet earth bundle harness the power of the globe with a new earth ball this ball needs no introduction with a design like that you will feel the power of mother earth in your hands when you send it soaring towards the fairway leaving your opponents dazed perfect for long drives and minimum wind turbulence the extra side swing will allow you will allow you to breeze past any obstacle with ease celebrate earth day with a little in-game miniature of your own grab them while you can we have power five top spin boost one side spin two and wind resistance one interesting ball and now we're gonna go into the store and we're gonna press it up like that and we're going to take a look at the overpower needle stability which is plus two this is the same as a titan and the reason i say that is because it's it's easier to to compare uh if, because most of us has played with at least one titan at some point and when it comes to the overpower needle stability on a ball like this it is even more important than what it would be on other balls that might have you know more wind resistance and stuff like that because when it is a power five and especially uh, bundled in together with a top spin boost and then with a low wind resistance this ball is going to be used in almost every single time it's going to be used it's going to be used in overpower so that's why the needle speed is extremely important this is in my opinion a tournament ball no uh, tour ball at all and the reason for that is the wind wind resistance is low the power is high and when we play tour play we generally want to have a fairly even ball like a power two power three with a wind resistance two minimum or maybe even with a wind resistance three in many cases on the higher, higher tours side spin two we can live with that absolutely in terms of tour play but i don't feel that this is once again going to be a tour play ball one so tournament ball in my opinion power shots and i you know i was kind of debating with myself how to write that but what i mean with power shots is you know this ball is going to travel a long way it's going to be basically be a boosted berserker and the top spin boost is definitely going to help especially those with a bit lower level clubs let's just picture yourself if you're playing in expert division with apocalypse level four where a lot of players is playing with apocalypse level five plus especially on the um, those shots that we're going to push and play with a lot of overpower and try to reach pretty far uh, as far down possible then that's a possibility the same in master those playing with apocalypse five and level six has a slight advantage uh, compared to those having apocalypse seven and level eight this ball can be used there as well to try to gain the same type of distance as would be getting with apocalypse level seven or level eight with uh you know with a uh, general berserker ball in my opinion so there is use to this type of ball and i do feel it's going to be used as i said already a couple of times in overpower and you know power hooks power slices and stuff like that where again we want to gain a lot of distance because the top spin boost on a power five ball is very valuable we all know especially if playing in master how valuable the spirit ball has come to be for those that has been lucky enough to invest in that when it came before so i do feel that this is going to have to be a ball that you're going to have to get some uh, for uh, you have to get some at least especially if you're focused on tournament if you're focused on tour play I honestly wouldn't spend anything on this one at all. I would just leave it be. I might just take the smallest pack just because uh, if you're a collector or just want to have because it's a good looking ball. But, you know, if you uh, grind, then no. If it's a tournament play, then yes. So I'm going to give this one, I'm going to give this one a 5 just based on that. Like 5 out of 10 in rating just because I feel it's a very valuable tournament ball that will come into use. But when it comes to tour play, there is no use whatsoever, in my opinion. 
5 out of 10 is my rating. I would like to know your thoughts in the comment section below. Please let me know how you would rate it and also why you rated it as you did. And you don't have to agree with me. Uh, you you can uh, think whatever you like, obviously, because that is the interesting part. But because we all see the different uh, value or like a different value with certain balls. Let's take a look at the needle speed in action. This is on tour 12, which is the strongest or like the, the fastest needle speed there is in the game so have that in mind if you're playing in a lower tour or for that matter playing in a tournament with less needle speed so there we do have it the earth ball for you all the planet earth bundle here in golf clash the game a massive thank you for watching and a good luck in your golf clash game